Well, good day, Mile Railroaders. Hope everybody's having a fantastic holiday um, for the 25th, uh, Christmas Day. That was our relaxed day. We did absolutely nothing. I sat on a couch, watched a bit of TV, watched a little girl open her presents, had a really relaxing time. I hope everybody else had a relaxing day for the 25th. And uh, other than that, it's been go, 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 go for myself and the family. Let's see, uh, everybody knows I got this renovation on the go. So yeah, we're giving it 110%, see how much we can get this done. Uh, we've got the two weeks off for Christmas holidays. And I'm shooting this on the 28th of December. So I have another week to go on my holidays and it's gonna be all renovation. Uh, we're at the point now that we're gonna be doing the drywall. And then of course we gotta mud it and prime it and paint it. Uh, we gotta put some carpets in upstairs and on the main floor we gotta put a hardwood floor in. Um, it's like that floating floor thing. A little bit of siding left to do outside. I guess that just takes a little bit more money and uh, they can get that done. Drywall was delivered this morning uh, before I even got out of bed. My goodness, that was at 8 o'clock. Wasn't awake yet, had to have my cup of coffee. Other than that, I'll take you guys around. I'll show you how the uh, renovation's going. And uh, hopefully soon, I can get back to my train set. I sat down there. I, I got all the HVAC system done. Uh, I did all that myself. And I went over to unplug the lights in the basement because they're right at the train set. And I sat there for five minutes staring at my train set and the layout and how much dirt and grime and dust is on it. And I'm just dreading the fact that I have to clean it up before I can use it. Uh, I have lots of new stuff. I'll post a video on some of the new stuff that I got for the holidays here. Uh, quite a bit of it, actually. Um, you got to buy yourself presents that you want, right? And uh, like I said, that's a, another video coming up. And then uh, hopefully after I get some drywall up and done, I can get down and clean up the train set, the layout, and... Uh, Start running some trains again, have some fun. Um, okay guys, uh, let's take a look around and see what's going on. And just a quick look outside, we got the uh, one wall outside done, the siding. You guys can, there's the outside of it. There's a car. Huh. I was just looking at this and you know the funny part about it is, uh, I've got the 87J slice there doing a uh, that model train station, uh, the Casio station from St. Thomas. And the end of my house almost looks just like it. Wonder if that's just a coincidence. So yeah, we got a little bit of siding on this side. Oh, here. Well, I guess all houses look the same, so. Went on a train station, right? And one side. Had the box in the uh, stack. Which is a little high. Have to get them to cut that down. And a quick look at the basement. There's only one light down here right now because uh, I have to find a good electrician to put some lights in. It's kind of a joke because I am an electrician. So for you guys that didn't know that. Uh, there's some wood for the new layout. I think there's six sheets of plywood there. And that's going to fill up this whole room. So like I said, I got the HVAC system all done up here. I don't know how well you guys are going to be able to see this with only one light, but put the new plenum down the side and there's four new runs coming off it. Main floor, second floor, going to wire up the sump pump yet. Run the lines to the uh, panel yet, just got some coils of wire. Kind of one of the joys of, when I first started in the uh, construction trade, I did uh, Plumbing, heating, and electrical. Chose to be ticketed in the electrical side of it, but uh, the experiences from that company were terrific because I got to come down here and in my own house do my own HVAC system. Good part is, it even passed. So I must still know what I'm doing. All right, guys, thanks. Okay, and on the main floor, we finally took out the uh, temporary wall here. So now we can actually walk into the new part of the house. And 
we got some nice big windows over there we got a sliding door with two eight-foot windows beside it you can see the HVAC system that goes up to the second floor on that one and then there's another one over there if you guys can see that and again get all the vapor barrier done I'm still gonna move over the light one joist space so it's in the middle of the doorway good part about the renovation I did not have to mow my lawn when we started this because hey I've got no lawn pile of dirt pile of rocks pile of wood I guess that's the one good thing about the renovation there's the doorway into the old place like I said we took down that temporary wall so there that is and the steps going upstairs so air return system for this main floor so yeah still a work in progress but like I said we got drywall sitting outside so oh, look I can zoom out you can see the whole wall there we go okay and coming up to the second floor now uh, the new bedroom that we put in games room whatever you want to call it uh, these used to be windows and I cut them in so I did that yesterday took the saws all sorry about the shaky uh, lots of coffee and I'm walking with this so but yeah I took a sawzall cut out the old windows now they're doors come in and we got all the vapor barrier done around the plug cathedral ceiling like I said we don't know how we gotta get the window there framed in yet and the other windows like I said so we should be able to start the drywall today And this room's gonna have two doors to it. So there you guys see up there in the ceiling. Pull the main beam down. There's the one old window that I've cut in. And that'll be a walk-through bathroom for this room. And then the other window that I cut into a door, and that's gonna be a walk-in closet when we're done. So if you guys can picture that all over here where the computer and stuff is I'm gonna frame up to be a closet then you just walk out to the main room okay guys there you got it and gals uh, that's the walkthrough for the renovation like I said I hope everybody had great holidays so belated Merry Christmas to you all Happy New Year and like a few of us have said and it's a smart thing to do if you're gonna go out on New Year's party as hard as you can but don't drink and drive and that should be the message that we're all sending to each other. It's a time just to have fun. But we all got to come home to loved ones. We all got to come home and watch some more videos on YouTube. So until later on, when I get down to the layout again, happy holidays. Bye, guys.